Hey guys, today we are standing in front of Chick-fil-A to try out something special. Today they have brought back their Smokehouse Bacon Barbecue Sandwich. Now it hasn't been on the menu since 2019. We've never tried it before, so we're gonna check it out today. Yeah, so we're gonna go in here and see what it's all about, and we're bringing my daughter Alyssa with us. So are you ready, guys? We're ready. Let's rock and roll. <laughs> Let's rock and roll. I want to look at Alyssa's meal first now. She opted not to get the new smokehouse. What did you get? I just got the grilled chicken sandwich with the new sweet yeast uh, bun on it. Well, let's see the regular chicken sandwich before we look at the new one. Hello. <laughs> and ketchup. I know, I know what you guys are saying out there. Ketchup, <laughs> but there's ketchup on there. All right, that's what the regular one. And you like this macaroni and cheese. Yeah, our mac and cheese is really good. Is it creamy? It's very creamy. Okay, so we'll let you take a bite of that bun. Chick-fil-A sandwich with ketchup. <laughs> it's really good. Can you tell a difference yeah. in the bun? Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's really good. I like it. Okay. All right, guys. I know you guys have been waiting for, what, three years for this. Let's, let's look at it. Bad thing is, we're not gonna be able to tell you if it tastes just as good as a few years ago because we've never had it. All right, here we go. Let's look. Got your yeast, sweet yeast bun, which is basically like a Hawaiian bun. There's the bacon. Three pieces of bacon. Pepper bacon. You see the pepper in it. There's the smoky barbecue sauce. Little Kobe Jack. There's the Chick fil A chicken. The grill marks. Green leaf lettuce. So, there we go. Right here. Let's try it from this angle. First bite. I can taste that smoky flavor from the barbecue sauce, but I didn't get any of that brown sugar bacon in that first bite, so I gotta go in again. All right, got some of that bacon in there. I taste the cheese. A little bit of the cheese. The cheese doesn't overpower the sandwich. Definitely has that smoke flavor. Now it's supposed to taste like it's coming right off a backyard grill. So let's take a look again at the sandwich. Chick-fil-A's grilled sandwiches are always good. I can taste a little bit of the bacon. To me, I thought I could I'd taste more of the bacon. I didn't uh, with the brown sugar, pepper. Barbecue sauce is good. It definitely has that smoky flavor, a little tang. It's a good sandwich. Just one more, go one more. Now we're gonna go to Bobby's. Now Bobby is gonna take the bacon off. Yeah. Let's just see, and you got yours like fried. Yeah. I'm taking the bacon off because I can't. Can't uh, eat the peppered the pepper. bacon. But you like, you'll be able to try the sauce You'll be able to try the new bun and with the Colby Jack. And that's a pretty good piece. Let me see it one more time. That's a good size piece of chicken. So what was that first bite like, Bobby? You can see the bun, how nice and soft it is. I could taste the sweetness off the bun. Um, always, they always give you a nice piece of chicken. I think they have the best chicken. The Colby Jack, taste that. And the staff here is very friendly. You taste the barbecue, this new smokehouse barbecue sauce. So could you taste too much of it on there? Not, because there's not a whole lot on there, but I can taste it. It's a little sweet. It's a good sandwich. So let's try the bacon by itself. Now this is brown sugar with pepper on there. So it's not overly crisp. Now eating it like that, you can definitely taste the sweetness of the bacon. Couldn't really get it on the sandwich. 
Can you taste a lot of pepper on that? Do you think I could have eaten that? You could that? have eaten that. Okay. I can't taste a lot of pepper. It's, uh, it's sweet because of the brown sugar. But we got some of this barbecue sauce. So this is a barbecue sandwich, guys. Let's do this right here. Put a little bit of it right there. So we're going to definitely get that. I'm going to get that barbecue in this bite. Now that's definitely a sweeter taste. There's a lot more barbecue sauce on there. That time I could taste a little bit of the cheese. So I recommend if you like a lot of barbecue sauce, get you the sandwich. Get you some extra barbecue sauce. And I'm going to have Bobby try the dip of fries in this sauce to see what it's like. Let's dip it in there. Some of that sauce. It's got a little bit of a... Um... The spice to it. I could really taste the you spice there. You could taste it there. better like that with nothing else mm -hmm. but a potato. I like that sauce, but yeah, it is spicy. I'm gonna try this fried piece of chicken with the barbecue mm -hmm. sauce. I mean, that's a big piece. It is. After trying, tasting these with the barbecue sauce on there, I like it. The fried, the fried one better. Man, that's it's big. Look how moist the Chick Fil A chicken is. It's a good looking piece of chicken there. Lisa pointed out that this was on the menu. Never ordered before. It says strawberry lemonade, wait, a frosted strawberry lemonade made with their lemonade and ice cream. Let's take a look. All right. I love lemonade. Lemonade's usually sour. I can't taste it, it's real sour. I can only taste the strawberry. It's good but I can't really tell it's a strawberry lemonade milkshake, I guess we'd call it. The strawberry puree. It's just kind of overpowering the lemonade taste. I want Bobby to try this to see if she thinks it tastes like lemonade. I taste a lot of the strawberry more than the lemonade. But it's good. Yeah. It's definitely this, good. But I'm a fan of their sweet tea. Oh, they can't beat your sweet tea now. Listen, how much was this? Uh, around $4. Around $4. So, that's not bad. It's a decent mm -hmm. size. Next time, I might just try the plain lemonade one. Here's the price of the new Smokehouse Bacon Barbecue. $10.59 for the combo. We just want the sandwich. $7.19. Well, we just left Chick-fil-A. And what did you think about it, Bobby? I would get that again. I like the crispy better than the grilled though. I like the Colby Jack that was on that. And the barbecue sauce, when we tried it with just the french fries, you could really taste that spiciness to it. It's good barbecue sauce. And I wanted to say, give them a shout out. Their staff is always probably one of the friendliest. And they get you through because while we're here, the line's backed up. It's like an assembly line, guys. I mean, it just keeps moving. So they do a great job at Chick-fil-A. My sandwich? Tasted great. I mean, it had the, had the bacon on there. Couldn't really taste the bacon. I could taste the bacon when I ate it by itself, but when I was eating with the sandwich, I couldn't really taste it. But all together, it was good. The barbecue sauce, like Bobby said, has a nice flavor. The Colby Jack. I like the bun. I like Hawaiian buns. Uh, it was just a good experience. And the uh, milkshake, I thought the milkshake tasted great. Now, I didn't get a lot of lemonade out of that, but still a great tasting milkshake. Lissa, what did you think about your chicken with ketchup on it <laughs> it was good i enjoyed the new <laughs> bun it was, so you, it was nice you mixed it up with the new bun today yeah, you can always sub the bun <laughs> all right you can sub and you can sub a lot of stuff here i think you can get about anything you want on these sandwiches so it was a great day here at chick-fil-a so if you like this video give us a thumbs up and subscribe yeah so until we meet again j, j and b have left, left the building, building.